Today, I'm going to show you how to reset a Honeywell generator, Siemens, anything manufactured through Generac. If somebody doesn't activate, they hit escape instead of activate, you get this. And, well, you cannot set it to auto, no matter what you do. You can't do anything except for start it. This generator will never go on and off when there's a power failure. So the first thing we have to do is reset that. To reset it, we have to take this door off. Five thirty two hex key. So you got those two screws. And then you got the one right here at the bottom. and out of the way. To reset this is we have to disconnect the battery and power to our controller so that we can reset it. So a pretty good spot where you'll be able to see most of what I'm doing. So now we're going to disconnect the negative part of the battery and then We'll go to the next spot. This is a half inch. Nut, you just have to loosen it a little. Battery is disconnected. After that, now we have to take the power from the controller right here. Is your power wire generator just went off and we have no display we can plug the generator back in you will get a little spark as you plug this back in that goes this way Okay, we're back on. Now that that's plugged back in, now we reconnect the battery. Battery is connected. Turn down the battery. Okay. Now we're coming up to the controller. We start with setting the language. It's natural gas. We do want the cold to start. And now we activate that. You have to have your activation code in order for this to work. Okay, now we set the time. Uh, 
11 18 fifth month 30th day of the 18th year exercise weekly quiet test mode never set quiet test mode sounds like the thing is trying to stall the whole time it's meant to run at 3600 rpms to get 60 clean hertz out of the rotor unfortunately it runs at half that speed and it sounds like well almost sounds like it's going to stall is what almost everybody tells me and it does well, i'm going to do two o'clock until i talk to the customer on wednesday okay now, 